morning, good afternoon, happy holidays, whenever this video finds you. Today, we have an awesome video for you because we are unboxing Chasing the Hobbies Funko Pop Mystery Box. And y'all, this thing is super, super cool. They sent me this box free of charge, and I'm so excited to dive into this box with you today. So let me go ahead and go over what this box is, who is Chasing the Hobbies. They are a mystery box company and have mystery boxes of all different types of things in the hobby genre. That includes Funko Pops. Now, they sent over the Funko Autograph Edition mystery box. It's important to know that they have a ton of different Funko Pop mystery boxes ranging from like $40 to $125. The Autograph Edition is $125. Now, let's talk a little bit about what is included in this box. For $125, the floor is $100, which means that if you purchase this box for $125, you have a chance of losing $25. That is the risk you take when playing mystery box games, but the average is $125, with the ceiling being $500, which means that's a pretty, pretty crazy Funko Pop. They say roughly every one in 10 boxes will have a crazy hit at least that's what their website is i'm gonna link them down in the description for you guys to check out on your own and if this box is worth it maybe it'd be a great company to check out all right without further ado let's stop wasting your time let's stop wasting my time and dive right into the box haven't peaked yet but i'm very very excited and y'all can we just take a second to like appreciate this box it is incredible okay we are going to pop it open they have some funko facts here on the inside of the box i'll get some shots for you so you can read them along with me but they say funko pop originated in 1998 which is way earlier than i had thought or anticipated the rarest of all funko pops is the exclusive one of one freddy funko freddy clear glitter creature and it was unveiled at a private event in 2014. That's kind of crazy. I thought it was that Willy Wonka one, but one of one is rarer than one of 10. They also have this super cool QR code. Um, share your openings with us, win a free mystery box. All right, set that to the side and let's dive right in. Not going to peak. Pop number one is Mrs. Claus and Candy Cane. Okay, this is a fun pop. This is definitely the time of year to get a pop like this. And if you can see, she is definitely carrying little gingerbread men. This is a super fun pop, and y'all, it's in it's in solid, solid condition. This pop came out in 2019, so we'll have to check PPG value on this pop. We'll do it on the whole box at the end. Okay, pop number two is Trigun from the Justice League. This is kind of funny. I just sold one of these today on Whatnot. If you want to check out my Whatnot live auctions, make sure to check me out down in the comments or down in the description below for my Whatnot live auctions. I try to go live at least once a month to go through some of the inventory that I have overstocked. Okay, and this Trigun is super cool. I think he is a super, super unique pop. He just looks so different compared to all the other Funko Pops. This is a really, really fun piece. Which means that the last pop in this box has to be an autograph. I watch a lot of Demon Slayer, so fingers crossed it's a Rengoku. Let's see. And we have a signed Zoro. This is signed by, I believe, um, Christopher Sabat, who also voices... I think he voices All Might. This is a super, super cool pop. I am so curious to know what the PPG value is. Love the green signature. It is certified by, I've actually never seen that sticker before. It's really hard to read, but it is certified. You can see the sticker right there. All right, so we're gonna check value of the Trigun first. Let's see what we're working with here. The Trigun is valued at $20. I believe the shared sticker is $20. Yep, the shared sticker is in fact $20. So I'm going to go ahead and write that down, make sure we're keeping tally. All right, so we are $20 in. Let's go ahead and check the PPG of the Mrs. Claus here. I have a feeling this pop may be worth something. I was wrong. $13 on the Mrs. Claus right there. So we have 20 plus 13. That comes to $33. Okay, now it is time to check what the Christopher Sabat Zorro Funko Pop is priced at and hilariously enough the tag is covered up 
Okay, so I had to do a little bit of research on this Funko Pop because Hobby DB had this thing listed at $500. As lucky as I thought I was to hit the top hit, I just didn't think this pop was worth $500, especially not being quoted. So I did some research and it looks like this pop sells anywhere between $100 and $135. So I think I'm going to value this thing at around $120. If we add that to our total, that brings our box total to a about $150. Y'all, I think this was totally worth it. This was a really fun and cool box, and I highly, highly recommend Chase the Hunt as your next mystery box destination. Like I said, they sent me this box free of charge so that I could unbox it for you guys to give you guys a little glimpse into what their mystery boxes are like. And hey, if you pick a box up, let me know what you pull down in the comments below. Well, guys, thank you so much for tuning into this video today. If you liked it, let me know by leaving a like on the video. You're still here, and it's free, so that would mean a ton to me. Make sure to subscribe. Do all the things to help the algorithm as we are on our grind towards 1,000 subscribers. And hey, maybe you've just started getting into Funko Pops after the holiday season, and you're wanting to know what your next step is in your collecting journey. You can check this video out right here.